up in my dream, and my dreams is my fixation. Yeah, they just want to see the enemy. Yeah, friends turn into enemies. Yeah, make it last question I got for you, man. The uh, Drake said, uh, you know, they're trying to do some type of tournament with uh, million dollar tournament. Yes. Yeah. What do you think? I mean, we don't know all the details yet, but obviously he said, you know, these athletes and uh, entertainers or whatever, they're going to put money up on their favorite person. I'm hearing 100 k on somebody. You know, like, on who? 100 k on who? That, that's what, I guess, for their favorite, for their favorite so person. So each person is going to put 100 k up on their favorite? On the person they choose. So, you know, whoever... Like James Harden put 100 k on surf or something like that. Definitely. That's his man. Yeah, I've seen them together. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, that's his so, man. So it's like, so my thing, you know, like I said, we don't know. The Yo, I, that, that's going to fuck up some relationships, though. A lot of relationships. Because it's going to be like, damn, yeah, yeah, like, like, yeah, that's going to be spooky. That's, that's going to be spooky because you're going to have to get a nigga with a big bag where 100000 ain't going to hurt him to lose. And I was, saying, I was saying that, too. So it's like, first of all, you know, not every uh, celebrity is going to be involved. In right. Like, uh, like <laughs> that, that is a lot of money just to be This is what I'm saying. You talking about the average nigga, like, like, now is uh, is Will Smith putting some money yeah, on him? Because that's a drop in the bucket for yeah, Will. Yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Will gonna put the money on Ness? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that's say, Philly. Philly. Yeah, so you know, Reed and all yeah. Yeah, Reed. Somebody he got to put the. But it's like yeah, it's a hundred thousand. Nigga lose me a hundred thousand, bro. I'm yeah. blocking your phone number, bro. And, and like you said, yeah, it's like so, it's gonna be a lot, a million, a hundred thousand. And again, who's judging that? And how are we judging that? Because and, and that that gets spooky. I hope it ain't Minnesota Luke. Yeah, and the last time and Luke, oh, yo, niggas don't even know Luke. Luke is a very credible battle yeah, rap source. So I yeah, wish yeah. he still did his blogs. That's how battle rap is. It's so what have you done for me well, lately? lately, lately, lately Motherfuckers don't even that, realize. Get him out of here. Yeah, he's he's, but he did some bad yeah, calls yeah, bad, on bad it. Calls, yeah, yeah, he, you know, I think. He, he was judging it like it was a fucking bacon contest yeah, or something. Some and, 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 it's, and it's battles. So I don't want to even understand why Luke was judging some of them shits like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's so informed on this shit, man. Those Minnesota Luke blogs were elite. Yeah, like those were, 100% true. Like, like that was some of the, the most informative. Like, like if you didn't know shit about battle rap, yeah, he, you, put you on. he put you on to the shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so yeah, we gonna have to. There's definitely gonna have to be some good judges, and, that, and that, that's I think that's the main point. The judges, like who you know, because <laughs> I think they're gonna have obviously want to have a entertainer, one of the somebody from I don't know rap or whatever, be a judge, and you gotta have two or three people from the from the culture. It can't be. But that, how how are you gonna get non biased opinions? That, in that, culture? That, that's that's what I'm saying as well too. So like if you like. Like the people that like so say somebody like a poison pen who's very informed yeah, yeah, yeah. on what battle rap is because he's been here mm -hmm. since they bought the bricks in, but he's Team Army so yeah, no, so 100%. so if he gets Team Army cat in there yeah, he gonna go yeah one hundred percent you know what I'm saying or you can go with your favorite rapper Drake or whatever LeBron somebody like LeBron and LeBron put a hundred k on Geechee or somebody like I'm going all right but <laughs> we gotta like so when are y'all gonna do this because you doing it in the off season. Because you, you you can't trust LeBron to be doing this shit during that, the regular season. That, that's another thing. Too. Oh, you mean putting up the bread or just, judging it? Not just putting up the, 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 putting up the, the bread. Just putting up the money. Right, right. Yeah. But you can have somebody judging and be like, you know what? I'm, I'm a LeBron fan. He put his money. This is what I'm it. saying. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a, it's a lot, lot that goes into that. Like this it's might be. Crazy. It's it's going to get. But that's gonna be good for you because you gonna get some good blogs out this shit. You know what I'm saying? But it's gonna get so. It's gonna yo, get yeah. What the fuck? You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Drake. Come in, yeah. you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You got the Drake eyes get all big. You get the camera on him, like yo, how do yo? It's it was, that's gonna be that's gonna be very interesting, man. That's a lot but of pressure. but it's it's gonna be that's gonna be all the the top of the top of the, be top, uh, the, of, yeah, of the yeah. elite, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Niggas gotta come outside, outside. I think it's gonna be top of the top, and maybe like a couple sprinkled in with new names. Cause like I said, we you never know who somebody's favorite is. Right. And they, they put money on them and things like that. Right. So everybody put up a. I think Drake could, could round that up. The funny thing, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna be completely honest, and this is what I'm talking about when it comes to Smack. Okay. When Grind Time got finished, you know who Direct is, right? Yeah. Direct what they're doing now. Direct wanted to start a league like this. Mm. You know. Give you a little bit of a backstory, all right? He basically told me, listen, I want to bring, like, big names into battle rap, and I want them to stand behind 
these battle rappers. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? This is what he was trying to build up after Grind Time. Um, and he offered me Young Miles. Mm -hmm. I wrote the three rounds for Miles. The battle never happened. I told him, I told Smack. Smack and Beasley had came to a show that I had did. I was performing in the city and they came down there. I told them I had three rounds for Miles. They said they were booking, but they dragged their feet on it. So Miles called me like, yo, we got, I got some bread for you. You could come battle in Detroit. Battled out there on some nasty ass league. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Which I didn't even understand. Like if I could do it all over again, I would have just waited. Okay. Even if they weren't gonna book me and Miles, I would have just kept because when you do shit like that, and I'm not just business period, not even just with them. Yeah, yeah, but it was like it kinda it was like, well yeah, damn, yeah. why you do that? And then you did it on a nasty ass league. Mm -hmm. it, it goes to show like like when they talk about like a cat like JC, when he battles on this little goofy ass league where y'all niggas is battling in the hallway, yeah, it makes your stock yeah, drop. Yeah, your brand, yeah. You know what I'm saying? It makes your brand drop. So but I say all that to say this. Direct wanted to do something very like that. The same way that Smack is doing it. Yeah. We're bringing in the big names and putting them behind the battle rappers. And Direct wanted to do that, what are we talking about, nine, ten years ago? And I'm pretty sure Smack and them wanted to do it nine or ten years ago, but it takes time. You gotta, you gotta work what it is that you're trying to do, and you might have to do some shit in between there to get your brand to the point where you could do that. Yeah, I think, I think you know, Direct had, you know, champagne taste with a bad budget, you know, <sighs> and 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 he he, yeah, he, yeah, he, he as as bad as he wanted to do it, yeah, yeah, he yeah, couldn't yeah, do yeah. it. And like I said, Smack probably wanted to do it a long time ago too, but it took time to do it. So yeah, stay your course, stay down for your come up. And, and and you'll get to where you gotta go, man. You know, but shit, man, let, let me in, man. Fuck, I don't even need the 100,000. Not yet, at least. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But fuck, <laughs> man. <laughs> this motherfucking rent in New York is sky fucking high. I like expensive shit. I like jewelry. I like hats, books. I like a lot of shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I need a, a, a couple of hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me a call, my nigga, for real. Let's get something going, man. Let's well, get let's something go, going, man. Let me let me get one of them, them small rooms, knock the rust off, and do what the fuck it is I gotta do, man. You know what I mean? I'm coming. I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna keep it humble for now. You know what I'm saying? Mm. I mean, once I once I get my shit off, though. You know I mean, I'll let y'all niggas know. Like you said, eleven more days at you know at the end of the thirty for thirty. End of the late. thirty for thirty. You know what I mean? I I I I, I put little Easter eggs in there, mm. and and you know different joints that I had where I'm mentioning, you know, where I started, what I'm doing now, mm -hmm. and where I want to take this mm -hmm. shit. Specifically, spoke spoke about Beasley, because Beasley's the cat that, that you know, I have dealings with on that side. You know, I don't, you know, I mean, I know Chico, I know Smack, um, I know Norbs, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, but at the end of the day, um, he's the dude that I could pick up the phone and call yeah, you know, like, yo, let's go, let's go to the juice ball. You know, yo, what cologne are you wearing? That type of shit. So it was, we, we've had, you know, personal dealings, but never really did the business together. Um, and I'm looking forward to doing something, man. Smack, what you want to do? ARP, ARP is the homie, you know? But I see ARP, he, he be booking a lot of these, these niggas that I never even heard of, where it's like, nigga, all you got to do is, this is how this shit is going to go. All right, niggas is either going to give me a shot and let me build my way up through there, or I'm going to build my shit up the way I'm building it up, and niggas is going to say, yo, he moving so much, we got to give him a shot. Him. Hey, remember you used to battle? Yeah, I remember. Y'all the niggas that forgot. You know what I'm saying? So that's the only way it's going to go. A nigga going to give me a shot and let me work my way up, give me the chance. I told Bees, give me the same shot you gave Reed. You let Reed come in, he had to... He had to yeah, you get see, accustomed yeah. to what he was doing. Next thing you know, he's main event. Yeah, hundred no, percent. You know what I'm saying? So somebody's even gonna do that and just give me the shot, or I just gotta keep working on my end, doing things, and and because you never know, because you only gotta be right one time. So all it takes is that if I do thirty of these and one of these shits Hit pops me. and go viral, then you know I'm gonna get a call. They're gonna be like, "Yo, boss, come over here." Yeah, nigga, seventy five thousand, nigga. You could have got me for twenty five hundred, man. Straight up. Yesterday's price is not today's price. Straight up. So yeah, let's get it, man. One hundred percent. Thirty for thirty. Uh, let the people know where they can follow you. At Bones Bagante. And Instagram, Twitter.
And then Cash App is at Bones Bugante with a one behind it, because I'm the only one, because somebody else got a Bones Bugante on there. And if you send some money to him, I don't know what to tell you. But shit, yeah, send after me at Bones Bugante with the one on it. Yeah, I, I want to go buy some more cologne. Yeah, 11 more days left. 11 more days left. 30 for 30. Tune in. 30 different videos, 30 different flows, 30 different beats, 30 different outfits. Yes, sir. And that shout out to Hip Hop is Real. Shout out to Hip Hop is Real, man. We out. Boom. Make every move like it's my last step. Trying to live life while I'm facing death. Yeah. It's crazy, ain't it?